Diane and this is the angel hug for Thursday the 16th of May and um, hmm. going to daily messages from your angels daily guidance and I'm gonna go for right we're still looking at gratitude and uh, we've got what do you desire and the card says you now have the opportunity to write the script according to your heart's true desires so just speaking about gratitude now gratitude and manifestation ah oh, very very important because when we're manifesting something we're actually uh, in theory anyway we don't always find it easy to do it but what we're doing is we are allowing a very powerful stream of divine energy to move through us and to guide us and we are also sending that energy that thought that intention out into the universe that's you know really what what we're doing at the essence of it we're kind of shaping reality we're 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 making stuff we're making stuff in the way that god intended us to make stuff to be co-creators to be able to uh, bring things out of this formless, shapeless uh, sense of uh, collection, rather, of, of atoms, of energy, of consciousness, of possibilities and probabilities to bring our desires out of that and to create form. So when we are hoping to do that and we are needing to run energy through us in order to do it, um, we need to have all of our energy flowing well. So we need to be really connected with a really abundant, rich, bright consciousness. So if we're all shut down and closed off and living in fear, we can't manifest anything. So this is why gratitude, another reason that gratitude is an important aspect of abundance, because when we get into a place of gratitude, the heart opens. You can feel the energy moving through you again. You can feel the, the heart um, chakra um, channeling divine energy all the way through and out across the universe. And if you're a light worker and you tend to use that to bring peace, to bring harmony and to, to send love across the universe, you know how powerful that feels. And that's kind of very similar to the manifesting energy. So when we're manifesting with love, um, we need to know exactly what it is we desire. That's number one. That's really, really important. And we also need to connect with um gratitude and connect with all of those higher frequency feelings but it's not just gratitude in that sense that it sounds like a word and I can actually feel myself closing down because I feel as if I'm theorizing it's something we have to feel we have to learn now how to come into our energy fields and feel what is going on inside each one of our chakras and feel what's going on with our aura feel where our energy is placed is it with us or is it out there somewhere are we holding it are we channeling it in the right way are we gaining mastery over it really that's what we're here to do um, because as we move more into the shift what's happening is we are becoming more amorphous and connected with each other and everything else so it's great because we are really becoming much more aware of the oneness and the connectedness and we also are having to learn how to remember where the demarcation is where do you end and I begin so okay let me read the message um, once you clearly decide upon your true desires and know that you're ready and deserving of them they'll rush into your life as if by magic and I'm going to add to that though that that knowing that we're ready and deserving of them is something we need to feel throughout our energy field. This is something my guides are always talking to me about. It's not just about thinking and believing. Um, it's about feeling and knowing and energizing it through us and within us. So, for example, if you say, I want this to happen, and then your heart closes down when you say it because the little boy or girl inside you at 12 or whatever doesn't believe you deserve it it's not going to happen so um yeah that's that's the message for today really focus on what you desire open your heart with gratitude and let the abundance of divine energy flow through you and help you to create it <laughs>